hello and greetings from the Real Relationship News Network. It's March, we're mad, so let's get at it. Live from Houston, we are all excited that U of H Go Cougs are a number one seed and we'll be rooting for them with tip off at 8.20 p.m. tonight. We are also happy to announce that USC Quincy and Monica's alma mater from this week's new episode, Love and Basketball, is in the tournament this year as a 10 seed against 7 seed Michigan State, setting up a complicated alliance for Courtney. Her father, Doug, is a proud alum of Michigan State, and it will be a true second battle of the ages as the Trojans battle the Spartans with tip-off at 8.15 a.m. on Friday. In other news, we have the Gonzaga Bulldogs battling the Grand Canyon, um, I don't know, uh, Rivers on Friday at 6.35 p.m., marking the 23rd year that Mark Few will lead the Bulldogs to the dance. And for that, we salute you. The Musketeers of Xavier meet Kennesaw State on Friday, and I, for one, and one for all, will be watching the Musketeers D'Artagnan and the Blue Blob, a chunky knockoff, if you ask me, battle it out. But really, if we're comparing, Xavier has two mascots, Kennesaw State has one, so there you go. Other teams we're watching this year, Courtney's sisters, Taylor's alma mater, UK. And you might be wondering why we at the Real Relationship News Network care so much. Well, the fact of the matter is that college basketball is who a part, is a part of who we are. My father loved going to Gonzaga games, and though neither of us are Gonzaga alums, we loved our hometown teams. Some of my best memories include watching Gonzaga games with my dad and cheering on our beloved team. I went to Montana Tech, and I'm a proud digger, and I promise you that is our mascot, Charlie Digger. But we're not in the NCAA, so Gonzaga is my closest team to root for. Courtney attended Ole Miss and is a Xavier alum, maintaining an alliance to both schools and being from a family that celebrates athletics. College basketball became another reason to join in the fun and enjoy the games. We both enjoy the excitement close calls, nail biters, and wins and losses that college basketball gives us every year. So let's look back at some of our favorite March Madness memories. back a lot of fantastic memories. On that note, other teams that won't be dancing, but we'd like to give a shout out to Murray State. My dad and I always rooted for them when they made it to the tournament. Ole Miss, again, a school Courtney happily and proudly attended. UNLV, where her boyfriend attended graduate school, and then Northern Kentucky, because that's just over the river from where Courtney lives, so we might as well give them a shout out. Um, and as always, Oral Roberts is in the tournament this year and uh, we're all laughing, but hey, it's none of our fault that a man named Oral founded a religious college. This year, seven teams are in the dance and the Lone Star State is happy to host the final 
four in Houston. And don't forget, if U of H wins this year, it will be the first time in tournament history where the host city is home to the winning team. From all of us at Real Relationships News Network, here's to the dance and let's start the madness. Thank you.